In this video, we will show you how to install OpenSSH to Windows. First of all, log on to SourceForge.net. Once the page opens, go to the search bar and type SSH Windows and then hit enter. Do this in order to get the setup for OpenSSH for Windows operating system. From the search results, hover the cursor on OpenSSH for Windows and click on the Download Now button. As a result, the zip file will be downloaded. Once the download has been completed, go to the directory where the file was downloaded and extract the zip file. Once the extraction has been completed, open up the extracted folder and run the setup file. Click on the Next button when you're displayed with the welcome screen. Next, agree to the license agreement, and then you'll be asked to choose the components that you want to install. By default, the server and the client will be checked. We will go with the default setting for the purpose of this tutorial. As a result, the installation process will begin, and you will observe that public and private DSA key pair files will be generated during the installation process. Once it's been completed, click on Finish. Now open Run and type CMD and hit Enter. As a result, the Command Prompt window will open. Over there, type SSH and hit Enter. You will observe that the command runs successfully, but here we didn't input the complete command, so this will show you the help contents. Now type SSH with the username along with your server's IP address. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will type the command SSH root at 192.168.190.130. You'll be prompted to enter a password. Enter the password and hit enter. With that done, you will connect on your SSH server from Windows using the command prompt. Now type the command ls and hit the enter key. As a result, you'll be shown a list of directories of your SSH server. If you want to go to a specific folder of your SSH server, type the command cd followed by the folder name and hit enter. Once you're done, type logout and hit enter. This will close the connection. In this manner, you can install and use OpenSSH in Windows. Thanks for watching. This was a howtech.tv tutorial.